Welcome. This is the demonstration and tutorial video for the ARM Sol 2 uh, modding toolbox for 3D Studio Max. Uh, in this short series of videos, I'm going to be showing you how to work with the toolset and going to pretty much work um, uh, through this model from start to finish from the way it is now, which is basically just completed modeling uh, to uh, imported P3D model in Oxygen 2. Um, what I have set up for this tutorial session is well, obviously you can see this model is editable poly. Uh, what you should take care to do if you want to eventually export your models into P3D format to be usable in RMSL2 is that um, the model itself has been carefully constructed to have uh, triangles and quads only, so no polygons with more than four sides. Um, and at the same time, uh, the smoothing groups of uh, all the polygons have been carefully looked at to make sure that the smoothing of the polygons looks right. So, for example, if I have these two and I switch out the smoothing group, they will look. Uh, jagged. So they should be smooth, for example, on curved surfaces. On flat surfaces they should be completely um, no smoothing groups applied, for example. You can see here. Okay, that takes care of the model. It's one object right now. Uh, you can see the, the pivot is somewhere randomly placed. Um, other things that I've really made sure to have is my folder for this in disk P. Um, I have my texture set up for a super shader. So I have the normal map, the specular map, and detail map. What I don't have is the uh, ambient shadow map, which I'll be showing you how to make in a second, uh, and the color map, which is basically the texture. I will be showing you how to put it all together to make sure it all exports correct. Now, uh, uh, let's start up the toolbox. Uh, as you can see from the previous version, there's quite a lot of new things in here. A lot of things have also been changed, so previous uh, from previous version, uh, things like the, the CFG generator has been completely overhauled. It, Many times better, with possibility to open, close file, open and save files, and reset, and so forth and so forth. It works much better now. <coughs> no. Okay. Well, the first thing I'm going to do before uh, for, for for the setup of this is I'm going to create something uh, new that hasn't been in the previous version, and basically it's just a three-point light setup. This will improve my visualization of the model in Max. So it's not extremely important, but you will see that it will just look better in the end, just in the viewport. So, okay. And quickly, I will demonstrate a log system, which is basically a mirror of the layer system in Max, but with a bit more uh, armor-oriented uh, direction and a few more possibilities. So right now I'm going to create a new LOD and you can see here I have different uh, ARMA2 presets already but I'm just going to say this is other. <coughs> and I'm going to take these lights Take these lights and I'm going to move them to other. Okay. And if you notice in the load system, if I press on the load, it isolates it. That's it. So now we're set up and we're ready to proceed. 